Alrighty guys, hi! My name is Anita Minute. I am part of the Red Show, local drag queen in Baltimore. We are going to be reading A Positive Superhero Growing Up with HIV by Desiree Thompson. It's a really good book. I've already read over it. <clears throat> hi. My name's James. There's James. I love James. Got to hang out with him a few times through the book. I like running and racing. Most of the time, my friends can't catch me because I'm super fast. When I grow up, I'm going to be a superhero. When I'm a superhero, I will use my speed to save the world by catching bad guys. Right there. You're going to get them. There is one thing that makes me different than some of my friends. I have a virus in my body called HIV. HIV is a virus that acts like a villain living inside of me. When I was little, my virus grew strong and multiplied. It started to take over. This made me really sick and slow. I didn't like how the virus made me feel. He laid up in bed. Aww. To fight off the HIV in my body, I take medicine called antiretroviral anti drugs, or ARVs. I take my pills every morning at the same time, when I eat breakfast. That way, I am energized for the day. There's his little pills. My medicine has special powers that keep my HIV under control so that I'm not sick anymore. Now my virus is contained and it can't take over my body. There's the virus in jail. Yeah, James, you get him. Sometimes I don't like taking my medicine, but my dad reminds me that by taking my pills, the HIV becomes weak so that I can be strong and speedy. This lets me zoom around and look out for bad guys. The bad guy in this picture is just my friend pretending to be a villain. Every few months, I have to get my blood drawn. This is when a nurse takes a sample of my blood to see how much of the virus is inside of my body. The needle poke hurts a little. I have to sit still and be really brave, just like a real superhero. My nurse tells me I'm heroic. After each blood draw, my mom hugs me and tells me she is proud of me. Along with taking my medicine and having blood draws, I see a special doctor a few times a year. My doctor tells me how much HIV is living in my body and how well my medicine is working. If there are any problems, he switches my medicine. Managing HIV is not hard. I usually forget I have the virus. The doctor is keeping James very well informed. Some people are afraid of HIV. They think they might catch my virus and get sick. HIV is not scary. No one can get HIV from being my friend. That's true. 
You know somebody with HIV, you can't catch it just by being their friend. I was born with HIV. No one would ever know by looking at me because I am healthy and active. I will always have HIV because there is no medicine that wipes out the virus completely. Maybe someday there will be. My mom and dad say I don't have to wait until I'm big to be a superhero. I already am a superhero by fighting my virus every day. He is a superhero. I love that. All right. Well, if you want, you can write to James. This says James loves to get positive mail. He regularly connects with other children that are living superheroes just like him. If you want to send him an encouraging note, stop by the author's website www.desiree-thompson.com and you can leave James a sweet message or a note of encouragement or uh, talk to James about what you might be going through if you were in his situation. Anyway, that is the book, A Positive Superhero Growing Up with HIV by Desiree Thompson. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you guys so very much. Enjoy the rest of the Red Show. Have a great one. Bye.